Hi guys, and welcome back to some more Game of Thrones. Okay, so we're with Roderick this time. Oh, it's Ethan's funeral. Oh, and our dad. I forgot his name. Whoops. Oh, so they let uh, Rion come. Roderick! It's you. Isn't it? Roderick. They said you were gone. They were wrong. Ramsay Snow did this. He did that to Ethan. You're going to hurt him, aren't you? Lord Whitehouse says you won't. Because you're a coward. But I know you will. He deserves it. What else has Lord Whitehill been telling you? Brian? That's enough. Uh, yeah, the feeling I would be interrupted for asking that. <clears throat> your little chat is over. I will speak to my brother. I will speak with my brother. I said you're done. Keep your distance or I'll drag him back to high point right now. What? I have to go back? No! I want to come home! Roderick, you should speak to Mother. Roderick? Are you going to forget about me? Are you? I will get you back. Not. I will get you back home. I promise. Please hurry. Man, I better get him back now after promising that. A story. No, no. You've had your chance. He's a child. What harm could it do? Make it a quick one. Damn right you'll listen to Talia. Mother. Come join the others. He's right there. My son. But soon they'll take him from me just like before. It's happening all over again. I can see it. My father's house was once mighty like this one. But his loyalty to the Targaryens cost us dearly. I watched as countless of our kin fell. Saw our lands destroyed. Everything we clung to was ripped from our hands. I can't watch that same fate before this family. Our house. My children. Our family is strong. Our family is strong, mother. We will not fall. Many men are strong, and still the night takes them. You must be ready to defend us, Roderick. Your body may be damaged, but your spirit must be like iron. You let nothing stand in your way, do you understand? Damn, okay, you Mom. You to murder every last White Hill down to the babes in their beds. No matter what, you must do it. Promise me. I will kill anyone who stands in my way. I will do whatever it takes. I'm good. I'm gonna assume babies won't stand in my way. Promise me. We will be ready, Mother. Mira, Asher, even Garrett. They all stand with us. We are strong. And seeing that baby thing, though, I have had a baby escape from my imprisonment in Crusader Kings too, so... You know... Would you say a few words, my lord? Oh, do I have to pick the speech? I need something inspiring, but sensitive oh, to the situation. It was everything. Everything I ever wanted to be. He showed me what it is to be a lord. He was always kind. I never knew a uh, man. And I am... I am sorry. I love your father. Ethan, my little brother. He was a true lord. When I left, <clears throat> he was just a boy. But when his house needed him, he rose to the task like a lord. He would have been proud. We honor Lord Gregor Forrester, my husband, my love, and our Lord Ethan, my sweet little boy. <laughs> but 
Now is time to say goodbye. Father and son are returned to the earth, to the ice. And from their sacrifice, new life begins. Iron from ice. Iron, Iron from ice. From ice. What was she putting in their hands? No, oh, okay. Light. This was a pretty nice service. Wow, that was actually gorgeous. That was really, really nice. Also, great voice too. But just listening to the lyrics, yeah, that really fit it in. Oh, is that us? Oh, I thought there was going to be more. Next time on Game of Thrones. What is going on? Roderick, you have to do something. Lord Whitehill's son has arrived. Griff Whitehill means to torment us. Nothing worse than a fourthborn with something to prove. It was bad enough when it was just the soldiers. We can't live with them under our roof. Form up and follow my lead. You'll be taking your vows. You too, Tuttle. Time to start proving you're a brother. Oh, the things we do for family. I wonder sometimes if it's worth it. All the sacrifices. Enjoy the wedding. How much further to Marine? A few days. If the Lost Legion doesn't catch up to us first. No. I overheard a couple of men whispering about the Lannister Guard. They're questioning people. Is there anything else for me to be worried about? What was that? Okay, episode 2 of The Lost Lords. You and 78.1% of players didn't forge Marjorie's letter. You and 38% of players kissed Lord Whitehill's ring. You and 57.1% of players lost Roderick's betrothal to Elena Glenmore. Well, it's good to know that I was in the majority with that one. You and 95.1% of players stood up for Cotter after he stole Finn's knife. And you and 92.2% of players killed Mira's attacker. How many of us kept the knife though? Eyes, eyes, 
Well, I guess that's it for episode two of Game of Thrones. So I do apologise for how short this part was. I genuinely thought there was going to be more. Um, at least another 20 or so minutes. So I, again, I do apologise, but I hope you guys have enjoyed the Let's Play of episode two of Game of Thrones. I'm looking forward to episode three. And I hope you're all having an amazing day, and I love you all. Bye!